Hey everyone, we are 2AM, that's two assholes on a microphone. My name is Dirk, and this is Crystal, and today we have Playboy the Beast with All Lives Matter. And this was requested by Shannon Garcia, and she tells us this is her favorite artist, so I can understand why. Yeah. Um, I don't think that we've had any requests from her that we didn't like, but the three that we, or two, that we've done from Playboy have been really, really good, so. Well, two and a half. Yeah. Because <laughs> he was featured on one, so. That's true. That's true. All right. Cartoons. Okay. Time's wasting. I'm done being complacent. I think it's finally time that we've had this conversation. My turn to talk. Shut up and don't say shit. Just okay, he's got that punchy thing going on. I'm going to have to put on different ears for that. <laughs> <laughs> We'll go back to the beginning then. Time's wasting, I'm done being complacent. I think it's finally time that we've had this conversation. My turn to talk, shut up and don't say shit. Just trying to make it, but you're like. My, my trigger talk, shut up and don't say shit? My turn to talk. Ah, okay. <laughs> it's about time we had this conversation, he said. My turn to talk, shut up and don't say shit. Mm -hmm. Alright. We've had this conversation. My turn to talk, shut up and don't say shit. Just trying to make it, but your lock is in his cage. We can hit a fair shake, but these court appointed lawyers, even if we go to trial, guaranteed it will destroy you. Some brothers stitching while the others copping, please. Systematic racism can't afford the lawyer fees. Black lives. Mmm. Systematic racism can't afford the lawyer fees. Mm hmm. Alright. Some brothers stitching while the others copping, please. Systematic racism can't afford the lawyer fees. Black lives matter too, I got a family to feed. But ain't no jobs where I'm from and I can't get a degree. So I'm about to hit the block and get this shit by any means. Cause where I'm from, there's no such thing as the American dream. Mm, okay, so he's kind of uh, straw manning the argument for the inner city situations. Mm. All right. Yeah. Black lives do matter. That's that's a, that is an, an honest God truth. But they're right. just they're just not they're not the only ones that matter. Right. Just shot my nephew, man. I swear he had his hands up. Shot him in the back while he was trying to pull his pants up. Killing fuck twelve with my middle fingers up. We would never trust the system. The government is corrupt. Fuck twelve. I I can't say I disagree with that. I don't trust the government neither. No. Um. And the system is corrupt. All of our systems are corrupted to a point. Oh, yeah. And, you know, it's because they're run by people, and people are generally corrupt. Well, people are corruptible very easily, and they're flawed. So. Well, what was this point I'm making? A person can not be corrupt, but people in general are. Yeah. Fuck 12, put my middle fingers up. We would never trust the system, the government is corrupt. Fuck 12. Black lives matter. Black lives matter. Black lives matter. You and I, we don't see eye to eye Though we both bleed red, we on opposite sides okay. I recognize that the left divides A revolution is coming, it won't be televised, no I recognize that the left divides The revolution Is coming, it won't be televised Okay, um, I, I like the way this hook is It's got a nice little flow to it's it bounce to it Yeah, and he his vocals are very smooth in it mm -hmm. Um I'm going to save what I have to say about the content of the hook for later. Okay. You and I, we don't see eye to eye, though we both bleed red, we on opposite sides. Yeah. I testify that big tech just lies, a revolution is coming, it won't be televised, no. What about my black life, it doesn't matter to you, you think you've had it bad, I've lived a hard life too. You were not a victim, brother, you were been lied to, bro, we from the same hood, I could have been like you. The rip Right, now he's doing the argument from a black cop's perspective, mm -hmm. saying, hey, we're from the same place. I just made different decisions. Mm -hmm. And, 
you know. Mm -hmm. I think I risked my life to make the world a better place, but now they calling me a traitor, Uncle Tom in a disgrace. I put this badge on with pride, it's such a slap in the face. I joined the army, went through training just to keep y'all safe. And this the things that I get, they wanna lower my pay. Man, fuck that, blue lives matter, I got something to say. I've seen too many good men lose their life in this job. I kiss my kids and give them love before I hop in the squad. Every day's another risk, but all I'm fearing is God. I know it's hard to worry from, but man, you can defy the odds. We don't want the same thing. I know that it's hard where we're from, but you can defy the odds. I am a firm believer th in that. I think no matter what circumstances you're born in, you can change them. It just takes a whole lot of grit and a whole lot of work. Mm -hmm. um, I am I am digging the concept of this song. It's, it's He's going from different points of view mm -hmm. on the same basic principle. Right. And I really, I really dig that. And that doesn't take away from the fact that the first perspective saying, okay, there are a lot of corrupt police officers, and that's Absolutely. not just in inner cities. A lot of small towns have corrupt mm -hmm. police officers. And it's not a race thing. It's a class thing and mm -hmm. a money thing. Oh, yes. <clears throat> and like, like you were saying, the second verse doesn't take any of the validity away from the first verse. No. It's just a different perspective. Right. But all I'm fearing is God. I know it's hard to worry from, but man, you can defy the odds. We don't want the same thing, yet here we stand so divided. We the people stand together, they fear us being united. Back to blue. Blue lives matter. See eye to eye, though we both bleed red, we on opposite sides okay. I recognize that the left divides A revolution is coming, it won't be televised, no Okay, I recognize that the left divides The revolution won't be televised Big tech lies, all those things are true um, I do think that the left divides But so does the right The right divides just, just as much It's just yeah. not as visible right now Yeah uh, it's getting that way. Oh, yeah. And they both are standing strong on their hard stances, and they're not willing to even entertain each other's uh, perspectives to the point of... It's <laughs> almost like some people want the conflict. Yeah, that's, that's exactly what I was getting ready to say. It's almost like they're kind of teaming for a fight. Right. It's like they're more into the aggression and fight of it than they are to the resolution to a problem exactly so yeah you and i we don't see eye to eye though we both bleed red we on opposite sides i testify that big tech just lies the revolution is coming it won't be televised no sell out to the hood don't give a fuck where you from we your truths are wrong past and it's the one that i'm on so don't you ever try to judge me you ain't walked in my shoes you think you have but you ain't never been through what i've been through just calm down and let me talk to your son. You need to take accountability for things that you've done. We can't. Oh, the one saying you ain't got the right to judge because you don't know what I've been through. And he's like, yeah, okay, fine. I, I hear that, but. You still have to take responsibility for your actions, you, you know? Right. And the fact of the matter is, when you make the wrong choices, when especially when you're young, mm -hmm. and you have to face the consequences for those choices. You should know what the possible consequences are going to be before you do the thing. Absolutely. Um, I've been in situations when I was young that were not good. I made a lot of mistakes. I was around a lot of people who were making even bigger mistakes, and I was going down a very bad path. And the consequences for the actions I was taking at that time could have been a hell of a lot worse than what they were for me. I turned away from that. It was difficult. And my situation was made even more difficult for a little while because I turned away from mm -hmm. that. <clears throat> but in the long run, I ended up better and with a better life. And you have to be accountable for your actions. And going in knowing that you're doing the wrong thing, you should know what the possible outcome is going to be. Right. Yeah. And 
if you do mm -hmm. it anyway, that means that you have or should have accepted that outcome. Mm -hmm. Yep. I don't know if that makes any sense to anybody. We're kind of trying to code talk a little bit because there's certain things we can't say on here and certain words that get flagged and... Mm. Mm. Yeah. Just calm down and let me talk to your son You need to take accountability for things that you've done We can't keep making excuses, I can't where you come from If I can make it, you can make it, man, just lower that gun Nah, it's too late for talking now, there's no going back It's death the present and fuck that, I'm not going back If I was white, we wouldn't be here and you know that's a fact This officer's about to kill me just because my skin's black Nah, we ain't no bad and you should know that by now And we don't really wanna hurt you, we can work this out But how do black lives matter if we killing each other? There's only in two ways, don't make me do this, my brother We both bleed red, we on opposite sides okay. I recognize that the left divides A revolution is coming, it won't be televised No, you and I, we don't see eye to eye Though we both bleed red, we on opposite sides okay. I testify that big tech just lies A revolution is coming, it won't be televised No My hope for songs like this and is that people hear this and they get to thinking, they get to talking with their friends, they get to talking with you know people that they know, their families, whatever, mm -hmm. and that people start to gain a different understanding of each other. Yeah. Songs like this are important, especially a couple of years ago when it was at its worst. Mm -hmm. But, and this uh, focused primarily on uh, African Americans and police officers. Mm -hmm. But it it doesn't end there. When he said when he says all lives matter, he it's he is in no way taking away from the Black Lives Matter original purpose right because there's a difference between the sentiment and the grassroots movement and what that was about and the um organization yeah so we'll we'll just we'll, we'll leave we would leave the blm thing at that but it, he in no way takes away from that he tries to give you a different perspective tries to give you some other point of view that you can grasp onto so that you can understand right and there are the corrupt cops in the inner cities and small towns all over the place mm -hmm. but there are also really good cops who are in it for the right reasons and they were brought up in the same situations yep. and the misnomer that if you were white you wouldn't get the same sentencing I think comes from the fact that it's assumed that if you're white you can afford a good lawyer or whatever yeah and we have family that's in and out of prison mm -hmm. um they're mostly white people almost exclusively you know? and you know their actions obviously put them in the situations that they were in but we also have family members who are in that shouldn't have been in and were in for a long time. In situations where, like, it was because the family could not afford a good lawyer. Yeah. If there had been a good lawyer in the situation, now that just happens it happens all over the place and it's not because of this it's yeah. because 
you don't have this. Yes. This right here means absolutely nothing. What really matters is what your last name is. Mm-hmm. And how much money is behind that last name. Yeah. And what your social class is. Mm -hmm. Obviously, we can't speak from a black perspective. I can talk about white and Hispanic perspective, but I can't, you know, like... And I can only speak from my own perspective of a heterosexual white man. I'm not going to say that we don't have certain privileges, because we do. But anymore, those are going away, for one thing, and they're not prominent. They're, they're nowhere near as prominent as people of other races and creeds seem to think they are. They used to be in this country. It used to be that the majority of the leaders everywhere were white. Mm -hmm. And then more and more minorities of all spectrum of minorities, not just black or Hispanic, but also Asian. We have Indian. We have all kinds of races in this country. I don't understand why we keep the focus on just the two. Mm -hmm. And that's part of the sentiment of all lives matter isn't just a black white thing yeah it was the there are other uh people in this country that feel like you know they need a voice too but it's not just it's not just that but it, it's not just race it's it's also your sex and and your sexual preference and religion and things like that we have so many diverse peoples in in this country that when they say all lives matter, they're not saying black lives versus white lives. They're mm -hmm. talking about black lives with white lives, with Asian lives, Hispanic or Latino lives, lives, sorry, <laughs> with police, firemen, atheists, Christians, Buddhists, you know, so we have pagans, so many pagans, everybody. so many different creeds and and cultures are in are in this country mm -hmm. that and that's what all lives matter encompasses whereas black lives matter started for a good reason it really did but it in the name itself it's very exclusionary and i think that spark that in and of itself didn't spark the issues as far as the all lives thing went i think um some very nefarious bad actors got involved and pushed things to make it that way agreed um another another issue uh the uh, blm's attack on the police mm -hmm. and that was back in 2016 yeah yeah so um, let us know what y'all think uh, if you want to join in this discussion if YouTube lets us keep this video up yeah um, then it'll be up if not it'll only be up for a few days but we still like the conversation and if you have any questions about what we were saying because I have no doubt that we probably weren't clarifying the way that we would like to. Uh, we would be happy to answer your question on our own perspective. Um, also, we'd like to hear your perspective. That's, that's right. kind of the it's kind of the point of this. Right. So, like, share, subscribe. Let us know what you all think. Visit Playboy's channel. Give him some love. Leave a comment down below for us. Be blessed, y'all. Peace.